In the Kwabri South District of the Ashanti region, Professor Nana Jinu Pukwajimai and her team first paid a courtesy call on all regions. They were grateful for the warm reception and informed the gathering of their agenda. The chiefs prayed for the team and offered some advice. From the palace, the campaign team attended a rally in the community. Professor Pokoajimai reminded the people of all projects initiated by the NDC government in the area. She pointed to the roads, schools and other infrastructural projects the NDC successfully executed. <laughs> Professor Nana Jane Pokwajimain and her team continue to the Tepa Chief's Palace and Nahafu Ano South East Zongo. The team called on the chief and elders of the community seeking their support in the December elections. The chairman of the party, Mr. Samuel Ofusu Ampofo, asked the Zongo community to remember the provisions, care and passion from the NDC when they were in power. NDC party in power. Anna, you know, no Muslim for Nizungo for Italy. In our back, I am with a year and this oppression and a bomb more day at the holiday. I can see me and look into the other and the future at the prayer. You know, I'm coming for a national holiday and this year in a binary the Hajj village. If you see what I must say, who call Haja? I call no cake. Professor Nana Jinu Pokwajimai asked the people of the Ahafo and North South East Zongo community to vote a mass for the NDC in the December polls. She said this will enable the NDC to continue the empowerment of women agenda and girl child education. Professor Pokwajiman says the NDC government is the only government that respects women and has their empowerment at heart. She called on mothers to make the upbringing of their children a priority. <laughs> The NDC vice presidential candidate thanked the people for turning up in their numbers and ask them to do same on December 7. In all the towns and communities, Professor Pukwajima campaigned for their votes to demonstrate their patriotism and loyalty to the NDC.